Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video I will show you a game between Levon Aronian and Nodirbek Abdusatorov. This is a game from WR Chess Masters Tournament 2023. Levon Aronian had white pieces and he started with e4. Nodirbek Abdusatorov played c5, the Sicilian defense. Knight to f3, d6, d4, c takes on d4, knight takes on d4, knight to f6, knight to c3, and now g6, the dragon variation. Bishop to e3, bishop to g7, f3, going for the Yugoslav attack, intending queen to d2, castling queen side, and the pawn storm on the king side. The game continued. Castling, queen to d2 as planned, knight to c6, white to move. g4. If h4, then black may play h5. So we have g4, but Abdul Satoru played h5 anyway. White to move, h3. g takes on h5, and g5 are the three most popular moves in this position. However, g5 is the least popular. But this is what Aronian played. And he surely knew the line well. According to Aronian, g5 is not about checkmating your opponent, but about placing your pieces on the good squares. The game continued. Knight to e8, castling queenside, queen to a5, knight to b3, queen to d8 was expected. Although in this variation white stands better too. Bishop takes on c3 was played, going for the queenless middle game. Knight takes queen, bishop takes queen check, bishop takes bishop. It is black to move, and this is another critical moment. f6 was played. Perhaps knight to d4 should have been considered. f6 is a blunder, according to Levon Aronian. Knight takes knight, pawn takes knight, g takes on f6, knight takes on f6. Who is better? White has a bishop pair, and black has a weak pawn on g file. White stands better. The game continued. Bishop to h6, rook to e8, bishop to c4 check, king to h7, bishop to g5, king to g7, rook from h to g1, a5, rook to g2, intending to double the rooks on the g file, knight to d7, rook from d to g1, bishop to a6, no trade, bishop to b3, knight to f8 defending the pawn on g6, bishop to d2, bishop to c8. All the black pieces are on the 8th rank. And this is not a good news for black, is it? a4, fixing the black pawn on a5. e5, blocking the diagonal, but this move weakens the d pawn. Bishop to c3, bishop to e6, rook to d2, a new target. Bishop takes bishop, pawn takes bishop, rook to e6, rook from g to d1, rook to d8. Why to move? Perhaps some players would capture the pawn on the a file. This is not a bad move. However, Aronian played even better move. What move is better than taking the pawn on a5? This is the move. f4. A killer move which collapses black's position. g5. Unpinning is also losing to f takes on e5. We have g5. But white played the move and black resigned. Pawn takes pawn on e5 is a good move. Aronian played f5, and Abdul Satoru resigned. If rook from e to e8, rook takes on d6, 
rook takes on d6, rook takes rook. And black has no good moves in this position. What a great game by Levon Aronian. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.